It's a lady in London here. Today I want to take you around London's Hampstead Village. This leafy neighborhood in North London is my favorite part of the city. There's lots to explore here from little side streets to great high street shops to parks that are some of the biggest and wildest in London and have some of the best views of the city skyline. There's a lot going on in Hampstead and a lot to love here. There's even a self-guided walk with a route and map on my blog if you want to explore on your own. You just have to go to aladyinlondon.com and search for it and you'll find it. In the meantime, let's take a look around and see what we find. It's easy to get to Hampstead. The neighborhood is on the northern line of the tube and there's an overground station at Hampstead Heath as well. Hampstead High Street is a great place to start a visit to the neighborhood. There are lots of shops and restaurants here, crepe stands, and red phone boxes that have been turned into coffee shops. Running perpendicular to it is Heath Street, which has more shops and restaurants too. One of the best things about visiting Hampstead is exploring the side streets. There are lots of little ones coming off the high street and radiating around the neighborhood and around the heath. The side streets in Hampstead are full of everything from blue plaques denoting famous people who once lived in the houses here, to small museums, pubs, and lots of other hidden surprises. There are little stairways to go up and down and lots of secret passageways that will take you to different parts of the area. It's fun to explore them all. Flask Walk is a particularly famous Hampstead side street. It's got a lot of great cafes and restaurants on it and it leads down to the Heath as well. If you're interested in seeing the best side streets in Hampstead, you can do my self-guided walk. It's on my blog and I've done a video of it as well.
Another of my favorite things about Hampstead is the pubs. There are great pubs on the high street and tucked away on side streets. The Holly Bush is a favorite, but there are lots of other ones too, and I love spending time at places like the Wells and the Flask. Given Hampstead's on a hill, there are great views around the neighborhood. Parliament Hill in Hampstead Heath has some of the most famous views in London, too. Speaking of Hampstead Heath, this park is one of the biggest draws to the neighborhood. This green space is one of the biggest and wildest parks in London, and it's a great place to come year-round. From the bathing ponds in the summer, to the atmospheric snow in the winter, and the beautiful leaves in autumn, it's a great place to come at any time of year. Another great thing about Hampstead is all the small museums tucked away in the neighborhood. From Berg House with its local history to Kenwood House in Hampstead Heath, there's a lot of them around. There's even houses that Sigmund Freud used to live in and John Keats's house as well. There's modern architecture and historic architecture and beautiful gardens too. And speaking of houses, there are lots of great ones to admire in the neighborhood. From the quirky Admiral's house to the house on Church Row that always changes the colors of its doors and shutters, there's something new every time you come to the neighborhood. I hope you've enjoyed this tour of Hampstead and that you get a chance to explore the neighborhood in person sometime. It's a great area to explore and I'm sure you'll love it as much as I do when you go. As always, there's more on my blog, aladyinlondon.com, and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel before you go. Happy exploring! <laughs>